Simone Holtznagel has revealed that she had a very special fashion item on while attending the Splendor in the Grass Festival this weekend. The model donned a pair of boots belonging to her late friend, model and television presenter Charlotte Dawson. The 29-year-old told news.com.au that the designer shoes are precious to her, but have sadly gotten covered in mud at the rain-drenched festival. These are priceless, these are Charlotte Dawson's vintage even she gum boots, she told the publication. She gave them to me before she died Simone added of the thigh-high black leather shoes. Simone also had on a $1,400 leather biker jacket, the publication reports. Charlotte was found dead in her Sydney Wulumulu home on February 22, 2014. Her death was later ruled a suicide. The TV host and model took her own life after receiving abuse from vicious trolls on Twitter. Famed for her role on Australia's Next Top Model, the New Zealand-born star, who was just 47, had a history of depression. Charlotte was found by a real estate agent just moments before an auction for her apartment was due to take place. Simone and Charlotte were known to very close friends, after meeting on Australia's Next Top Model. In 2019, Simone revealed she was on a quest to scatter the ashes of the late model all around the world. She told the Daily Telegraph, Charlotte's ashes are in Bali, New Zealand, Bondi, and I have a little bit I'm going to scatter at all her favorite designer stores on Rodeo Drive, in Los Angeles, and all places fabulous. Simone was celebrating her arrival at the Splendor in the Grass Festival in Byron Bay on Friday, just hours before disaster struck. The model posted a series of videos and photos to her Instagram stories, showing off the scenes at the Smirnoff vodka tent at the event. She documented the glamorous surroundings and sipped on a beverage from the brand. Simone also posed alongside her celebrity trainer boyfriend Jono Costano and Bachelorette star Conrad Bien Steven. We made it. Simone boasted and also indicated she was attending the festival in the capacity of an influencer, tagging her posts as ads. The first day of Splendor in the Grass was then cancelled due to extreme weather conditions after torrential rain turned the music festival into a mud pit. Event organizers closed down all four of the main stages at North Byron Parklands, in northern NSW, on Friday. A significant weather system is currently sitting off the east coast and may reach land later today bringing more rainfall, Splendor and the Grass organizers said. In the interest of patron safety and in consultation with all relevant emergency services, we have decided to err on the side of caution and cancel performances on the main stages today only.